Yeah, we're here in this neighborhood right behind Lake Hefner Parkway where fires have inched into these people's backyards. As you can see behind me, you can see the grass is just scorched and flames actually burning this home's shed and attic. Thankfully, fire crews say no injuries. Now, this isn't even the only fire that's popped up in Lake Hefner or our surrounding area. It was also a tragic day for Comanche County. Emergency management has confirmed one of their firefighters has died battling a large wildfire. This fire is burning off Northeast Kings Road and Lake Ellsworth. As of right now, we don't know the details of this tragedy. We do know a mandatory evacuation is in effect for all residents and businesses from Lake Ellsworth to U.S. Highway 62 and Northeast King Road to two miles north of the Caddo County Comanche County line. Now, fire crews are also busy battling two other fires in the area. The city of Tuttle dealing with a large grass fire near Rock Creek and Frisco Road. Neighbors coming home from a church this afternoon saw flames approaching their home and took action. We got hose and hooked up in case we needed to water grass. So we were prepared. Yes, there was a little bit of of uh, anxiousness. Oh, I just want to thank all the firefighters for putting her putting her life on the line. And a third grass fire burning in McLean County, that fire burning east of Blanchard. Now a high fire danger was expected today. The National Weather Service in Norman issuing a red flag warning until 9 p.m. tonight.